Hey guys, what is up here? So this team today we're showing you how to set up a PC and a monitor. So the first thing you're gonna do is pretty much well I don't know if you're not well you're gonna need a PC and a monitor obviously. <coughs> Alright, there. So what you're going to need is a PC and a monitor. So, before you're done with that, you can pack all your components, like for example, keyboard, mouse, or anything like that, and just lay it down. Just lay it down with where it can fit, or the most appropriate spot. Now, if you would have USBs like this, but if you don't have USBs, you just plug it in uh, where those circle things are at. So, let's come over here and you can see, right? So, there's USBs like right here and all that stuff. So, I'm going to plug this thing on the USBs. Again, if you don't have USBs, use these two things. <clears throat> so, the uh, keyboard is plugged in. Uh, now, exact same thing for the mouse, obviously. My mouse, you plug it in. My other uh, mouse is USB also. So, I plug it in. Make sure the wires don't get, you know, tangled. Because I, that's like the worst feeling. Well, it's not really a feeling, but I don't like my wires getting tangled up and all that stuff. But, happens. Go to the monitor. The next thing you want to do is most, my computer comes with a power brick. But if your computer does not have a power brick, you can just skip this part. If it does, then you just watch. So what you want to do is you want to flip your monitor over like this. Just turn it around. And then there will be like a little circle right here. This is what this part is for. So what you want to do is you want to connect it. Connect it. There. Now you would have the power brick. So what you want to do is you would have a power cable like this and this so so what you want to do is you want to plug this part in so look see the most exact thing so what you want you want to plug the power cable and connect it to the power brick Now you want to put the power brick somewhere secure, or it won't like won't be in the way. So now, when you're done with that, you want to plug it in. So now the monitor is on. Well, it's not on right now, but the monitor. So I connected the monitor. I successfully connected the monitor. The next thing you want to do is let's go back. Let's go back to the PC. So the next thing you want to do is <clears throat> there's VGA. I don't know what that purple thing is. DVI and HDMI. What I have is HDMI. Or VGA. I have HDMI and VGA. If you have VGA, you just plug it in and then you just screw it. And then when you're done with that, you screw it to your, into the monitor. So what I have, I have HDMI. What I'm going to do with HDMI, I'm going to connect it to the PC like this. Like that. Connect it. Make sure it's like, I double check sometimes because make sure it doesn't. No. So let's go back to the monitor and just 
still flipped over, which is good. You don't have to pick all the time to <clears throat> spin it over. You can just like, not in a second, probably. So what you want to do is you want to plug the HDMI cable in the monitor. Now it's in. Now, make sure the cables. So that will be the last thing, obviously, if you have my, like, the type of computer I have. Next thing is another power cable. <clears throat> Let's pop it up to the PC. Now there's a thing right here. I have a different type of PC so that power isn't, like, right here. So you would have to plug this in into the PC. When you're done with that, you want to connect the PC, I mean, well, get the port and plug it in somewhere, or whatever. <clears throat> Great. Now, the first thing you want to do is actually turn on the... PC first. That's the thing you want to do first. And PC was on. Now what you want to do is turn on the monitor. <clears throat> now if the monitor doesn't work, just flip over the power brick. Or the pa this. Or the power brick because you want something weird. Happens to me sometimes like that. Now what you want to do is turn on the monitor. You guys are probably running something else, but I'm running Ubuntu. So I hope you guys like this video. Uh, yeah, I have a PC now. Uh, I love it. It's Ubuntu, as you can see. I'll put a close up look. Ubuntu. My PC is working perfectly fine. Uh, <coughs> Everything's on correctly. Everything was all green and stuff, so everything's perfectly fine. This is green. Everything's green. The battery is perfect, and the CD drive is perfect. So, let's go to the other side. Uh, it takes quite a while. Well, it doesn't take quite a while, but... <clears throat> And if you like your battery runs out or something, like if it like, like doesn't work, if your PC doesn't work as much and it keeps on blinking, that's because you need a new like battery. It looks like this. This is an old battery. Well, this is an old battery. Oh, this was the battery that was in before they kept on beeping and stuff. So this is an old battery. And yeah. <clears throat> now my Ubuntu is coming on. So you will know if your uh, keyboard is on because you plugged it in earlier. Just plugged it in. Let's put it back real quick. PC's right here, by the way. Let's go make a sound so I don't get scared. Well, I might make a sound. <clears throat> yeah, that sound. So, good thing I have a mouse and it works. I'm sure it works. Yep, it works. I, w I just want you guys to see the Ubuntu I'm running. That's why the video should be over right now. But I just want you guys to see my Ubuntu. Now, if you're running Ubuntu, see, so yeah, I, I did. I know I do have to not work, but I didn't plug it in, so that's why it's not. And there you go. Your PC is work now working. Everything's all fine. I hope you guys like this video. 
If you didn't, don't push nothing. If you did, hit that like button, like, comment, subscribe. If you guys want more videos like this or anything, uh, leave a comment below. Let me know. And um, <clears throat> if you want more uh, tips and tutorials, uh, if you need guys need help more to set up the PC or a PC, just let me know. And yeah, I really hope you guys like this video. Uh, yeah, make sure to subscribe for more. And hope you guys like this video. If you didn't, well, yeah, I already said all this stuff. Subscribe.